Now, News 8's Spring Into Action food drive taking place at the ShopRite in East Haven. The Good Morning Connecticut team is helping collect non-perishable items for the Connecticut Food Bank. News 8's Ken Pierce is live with a look at how everyone is helping out. Hey, Ken. Hello there, Brian. It has been going great so far with a little less than an hour left in our food drive. We're we'll just take a look inside this truck. We got three big containers amounting to 3,000 pounds worth of food that we've already connect collected so far this morning for the Connecticut Food Bank. People are still coming in, dropping stuff off, and we've got a party atmosphere in here, that is for sure. Keith Coons almost dropped some food, but he caught it at the last second here. Laura Hutchinson is here, too, along with Chief Meteor yes. Meteorologist Gil Simmons. Laura, how have things been going so far? You know, Keith and I were just talking about how overwhelmed we yeah. are with the generosity. I think my arms are hurting from yeah, carrying in all really But I know there are people in there shopping now. We're going till 1. For it sure. has yeah. been fantastic. So many people have been coming down to the shop right on Route 80 in East Haven. Take a look. Three, two, one. It was a morning of selfies with some of your favorite TV people. Two best looking guys in the room right here. All for doing something very selfless, donating non perishable food to the Connecticut Food Bank. Uh, so, the Connecticut Food Bank serves about 300,000 people who do not know where their next meal is coming from across Connecticut. Got some stuff for you. Folks like John and his fiance know that hunger is literally right next door. We know some people struggle a real lot, and we just do it just for. Give back. Just yep. to give it back. Yep. Yeah, yep. to help out. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, it's awesome because I might need this someday. Oh, well, because I know people are in need, so. They certainly are. Give a little, but we can. And some of those who can gave a lot. Quinnipiac University dropped off $5,000 worth of grocery store gift cards. Which is equivalent to 12,000 meals. So we're very, very happy to do that. We're very community-minded. Uh, having a strong sense of community is a core value of Quinnipiac, so we feel very good about taking part in this. So do all of those in the News 8 family. We do a lot of stories on food drives during the holidays, but did you know one of the times of biggest need is actually coming up? During summer hunger, when kids are out of school, they don't have access to free and reduced lunch at school. Um, we, we are serving those children. We're serving their families. Um, hunger is a year-round issue. And we are going to be going until 1 o'clock today, still looking for more donations if you want to stop by. Things like canned tuna, canned chicken, dried beans, canned beans, low sugar fruit juices, cereal, whole wheat pasta to make sure we're not going hungry during our food drive. Thanks to Gia Marie's for donating pizza to us. If you want to stop by, we're here until 1 o'clock. We're at the shop right on Route 80 in East Haven. Just get off I 91 exit 8. Come east on Route 80 over the hill from New Haven. You'll find us here on the left. Live in East Haven, I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.